All right, guys, it's day number 573 review video for S Group, I believe. Let me just go to my YouTube channel here and check that last video. Oh, I didn't put the day on here. Oh, I know why. It's because I did two videos the same day. Yeah. So, yeah, day number 572 is today. That's why I was thinking. I'm like, wait a minute. I remember typing in 571, but it. It wasn't my last video that I did. So yeah, I did these two videos on the same day. You can see they're 12 hours ago and this one's um, 15 hours ago there. And uh, yeah, this week guys has been freaking amazing in S group um, because I had two people come in with uh, one guy came in and so far he's went, he's put himself to like 40 K. So he's uh, you know, his goal is to get to a 50 K investment. And then I had another guy um, over the week uh, younger guy, younger than me, uh, come in and he's getting himself to, to 50 K, um, as well. So, uh, pretty big week guys with commissions. And that's why you know, I've been pumping out these videos. Um, because you know, the best way to promote something guys is proof of income, right? Like if I can sit there and I can pump out, you know, as I did this week, we've got, where's my, weekly update video was four days ago. So it would have been my weekly update video would have been this one here, right? Roughly, I think. Um, where's the one that says midweek? Uh, withdrawal. Withdrawal. I thought I put a video called midweek something. Anyways, I think this one here was the weekly update video from Friday. So we had one, uh, two, three, four, five, six videos. That seems way too many. One day ago. Yeah, I guess it was about six videos. And then this will be the seventh video for this week. And guys, this is kind of a marketing strategy that I'm doing here. Um, you know, I don't need to make so many videos, but um, marketing strategy, guys. I'm putting out a video like every time I hit about $600 in my available balance there right? I'm doing a withdrawal video because the more withdrawal proof I have, the better, of course, for myself with promoting, but the better it's going to be for all members promoting. Because here's the thing, okay? This is the thing is people that are kind of uneducated about making money online and investing is it's the same thing. And I know I've said this in other videos before, but this analogy is probably the best example. And this is a withdrawal video. So just keep on watching. I'm just kind of doing a little marketing training here and explaining why why I've uploaded so many videos this week because um, it's a strategy guys and I always kind of use this example is think of it this way like what are people attracted to like marketing is you're making content right if you're not making content you're just spamming people like if you're just messaging people randomly on Facebook saying you know trying to talk to them and then saying, Hey, look what I'm doing kind of thing. That's just spam. Cause they're not coming to you. They're not interested in what you're doing. They don't even know who you are kind of thing, right? Normally the best thing to lead with is to answer the question. Why did you join? Okay. Meaning why did I join? Okay. If you can answer that question, then normally you're going to be able to answer the, the leads question, right? Cause here's the thing you got to think of when you're marketing, you have to think of the mindset of the lead. Like what is the lead doing? Okay. They're going to Google. Okay. They're typing in, um, S group login solution companies review. Okay. So these are the top searches when someone types in S group. So login, that would be for members, right? They're looking for the login page, which is the worst thing you can do is go to Google and type in the, the name of your company and then login. Because if it's a big company, there's going to be fake websites and that's how they get your login information. So never, ever do that. And you can see here, guys, that's the number one searched thing on Google with S group is login, which, um, you know, it's just guys, you really got to think when you're making money online, right? Like if I was to click that, right, who knows, there possibly could be a fake S group website where if I log into that, now they have my login information, right? And then if they were to have, you know, uh, hack into my telegram bot, they could actually get into my account. Okay. So, you know, by them doing that, I, you know, they could only do a withdrawal, um, but it would take, you know, I'd have to have a balance available in my account, um, for them to do that. I would, uh, 
you know, I would not have to log into my account for like 24 hours because it takes about 24 hours to do a withdrawal out of S Group. So most likely if someone does get into your account and you have an available balance and they decide to withdraw it, you can just send in a support ticket or come in our EN chat and just say, hey, my account's been broken into, you know, what are the steps I need to do? And it'll get taken care of. That withdrawal will be canceled, right? So no problems. But Here's the thing, guys, is that you can see here that there's a lot of suckers online, right? So why I'm talking about suckers online is because when people are researching something they want to do, like something they want to invest in or join, normally what they're going to do is they're going to be attracted to negative news. So they're going to type in S Group, right? They're going to click that, okay? S Group British Investment, that's the direct link to the website. This is something else, guys. This is like a real estate company or something. But anyways, that's the uh, direct link to the website there of S Group. But then if you scroll down here, um, I haven't looked at this in a long time, but uh, normally, you know, if you just type in the name of a company, you're going to find blogs. Okay. And one of the biggest thing, like if we go here and I just type in scam. Okay. And this is, you know, a lot of new people will just type that. They'll type in scam. So they'll actually be looking for what other people are saying uh, that it's a scam. But you got to remember when you go to these websites, you know, like for instance, this one here, you can see I don't even bother looking at this stuff, guys, because it's just stupid, right? Um, but they're trying to prove to you that it's a scam, Right? They're trying to do everything they possibly can to prove to you that's a scam, where it's even some things like this here, what he's saying is just racist. He's saying that, you know, this, uh, uh, you know, like Ukraine and uh, Russian and Ukraine members and stuff like that. And he's saying it looks fake because they're from Russian and Ukraine and stuff and type thing like that. But if, if he had taken the time to look into it and stuff, he would have noticed that uh, the company is uh, Russian ukraine based company like the administrations from russia and ukraine now they live in the dubai of course right but he's saying oh look it's a british investment thing but um you know the members the majority of the members that are doing webinars and stuff like that um, which he says are there it's fake right um are uh russian and ukraine people right so you know guys here's the thing though if no one has if the the lead right that comes across your content you know, and, and then they go and they start to do their own research online and they haven't created an account and they haven't deposited a hundred dollars to do testing with, they're going to come across this stuff because they don't know any better. They're not, you know, they're not active members. They're not in our active members group. They haven't met any other people that are doing presentations and, you know, uh, chatting with them and, and Hey, yeah, I'm making money in S group kind of thing like that. Talking to other members, guys. They're going to come across this stuff and they won't know what to think of it because they don't know any better. Okay. So the best, me going back to saying this guys, the best kind of content that you can make is proof content, proof that what you're doing works because it answers the question that, that is, why did you join? Right? Cause someone proved to me, I saw proof that this works. So that's why I joined, right? The real purpose, and, and I know a lot of people out there when they talk about their why, why they're doing this, or you know why they joined that website or whatever, they're going to give you some bullshit story like, oh, I'm doing it because I want to change my family's life and stuff like that. Guys, you know, you know if, if people are honest out there, their why they do something, why they join a website, why they invest, it's to make money, right? And they do it because they can see, oh, this is going to be a stable income for me is why they do it. So if, you know, if you can answer that question, that's why you joined because you want to build an income, right? You want a stable income. And that's why you decided to join S group. If you, you know, if you're thinking, Hey, I just want to make some kind of income, right. And you don't care how stable it is. And you, you went in there with the mindset, Hey, I'm going to join 10 different opportunities. And I know that, you know, most of them won't, won't even make it a year, but I'm going to, you know, throw shit at the wall and see what sticks kind of thing. And that's a strategy that some people use. Then you would, your mindset would be different, right? Your mindset wouldn't be, Hey, I want to join this because it's stable. And I don't care if, you know, once a month or something, one of the days come along and I earn 0.13%, right? Okay. So, you know, to me, that just says it's not a Ponzi scheme because if a company can do that and keep on going for years and years and years, 
then, uh, you know, have you ever seen a Ponzi scheme do that? No, you haven't, right? So, um, yeah, guys, like you got to really, when you're doing content and stuff, think about what you're doing. Think about the mindset of the lead. Why would they want to watch your content? Why would they want to continue to watch your content, like follow you and such, okay? Is most of the time, they just want to see that you're making money. It's that simple, right? Okay, like this. So on the opposite end of things, like basically this here, right? This, if I was to type in S group scam, I'm going to get a bunch of scam blogs about S group, right? If I go and I look into it, actually, we'll just take this because we've already been here and I look into this, you know, me as a marketer and me as being online for 13 years and, and seeing this stuff, I just seen it so many times. I can see exactly why this person or who, who knows, it could be even a team of people have went and built this blog, right? They're, all they do is do scam reviews, right? So everything's about, hey, this is a scam kind of thing like that. And, you know, if you do that, eventually, sometimes you'll be right. Probably the majority of the time you'll be right because 98% of make money online opportunities don't last a year. So they know by creating a blog around that, you know, everything online is a scam of making money, that they'll be right 98% of the time because 98% of the time things will fail. But yeah, guys, it's pretty simple to see what's going on here. They just do reviews on saying everything's a scam basically. And then what's, so by looking at this, you know, what is the purpose of this? Like what's the purpose of this blog? The purpose of this blog is not to inform you um, that, hey, I think S group is a scam. That's not the purpose of it. The purpose of it is if you look at it, you can see they're making money from it or they're building an email list, okay? So if you don't see ads all over it, like this is an ad here, if I was to click on this, it's gonna go take me to something and eventually I'd have to buy something or be offered something, which it's not even opening up, sorry guys. Oh, there you go, okay? So this here, I don't even know what this is, but obviously if, if you know I'm talking to someone here, they're gonna try and sell me something or I don't know what this is, this company here is paying probably a big marketing company to advertise online. And that marketing company is, you know, advertising on here basically, okay? On this blog here. So uh, yeah, you can totally see the purpose of this uh, content here is they don't care about what they say, they care about how much traffic they're getting. So they're only gonna put out blog content about what is getting traffic. So S group is popular now, it's getting traffic, and that's probably why they didn't put out a blog about this in 2019, right? They put it out in 2021 <laughs> kind of thing, right? Even though it's been successful, like the training day has been successful since 2018. So um, yeah, here's another thing, guys. I don't know if this goes to the same place, but you know, it's clickable, okay? There's another one that looks like a different thing, Squarespace, I think that's a website builder. Okay, here's another thing here. This is Squarespace. This is the same ad as that. Okay, but they're all separate ads, you can see, right? And I bet if I was to scroll down, there might be even something else down here. You have to put in your email address to leave a comment, so they're list building, okay? So you can see, guys, if you take the time to look into this stuff, you can see exactly what's going on. You know, if I was to go to anything else, we'll just go to this right here. This is not about S group. This is just about something else. Right, I can see there's ads there. There's an ad there, right? The same, that ad space up there is not being used, but before we saw there's an ad there. There's an ad here, there's an ad there. Um, and then if we go down, there's still list building, okay? So, you know, guys, when you're looking into this stuff, there's a yin and a yang to everything, right? So you gotta understand that your prospect that's, you know, typing into the internet, S group or whatever, they're gonna be attracted to not your content, which is extremely sad it, because your content, if you're promoting something, is normally the positive end of things. It's the positive content. Hey, I'm making money. This is changing my life. Like that's basically what my content is right now is I'm making money and this is totally changing my life. That's what it is basically, right? Because I'm making enough money to change my life now in S group, right? So that's extremely, extremely positive. But the average person, the average mindset is attracted to negative news. Okay, so if, for instance, if you go to Facebook, YouTube, any social media uh, platform, guys, and um, say you follow, I don't know, say um, you've subscribed to Justin Beaver's YouTube channel, or you've, 
you follow Justin Beaver on uh, Facebook, like maybe, Ju I don't know, maybe Justin Beaver has a Facebook page, which he probably does. Um, you follow that page. Okay. So now that social media platform and Google's the same way, right? That social media platform now understands your likes and dislikes. Okay. So what they're going to put in front of you is news that's going to trigger you, right? So for instance, if Justin Bieber was to, I don't know, um, pass away or something like that, right? If he was to pass away or if he was to go and do a concert and make $30 million at the concert, right? What news would you be attracted to? Would you be attracted to the news? Hey, your favorite celebrity just passed away, right? What would happen if, if that happened? Guys, the internet would go crazy. If Justin Bieber died, that's all we'd see in our newsfeed, right? Um, or on the opposite side, the positive news, the content, if he goes and does a concert and makes 30 K or 30 million at his concert, which is a lot of money that would change everyone's life. If you made $30 million in one day, your life would be totally changed the next day or that day. Right. Um, do you ever see that kind of news in your news feed? You never see it, but you know, it happens all the time. Probably every time he does a show, he makes that much money. Maybe the guy's worth what? $500 million or something. Right. So guys, you can kind of see what I'm saying here is, really think about your prospect and, and the the mindset and what they're going through. Okay. So if, if you know, and you understand that, Hey, okay, I'm in, this is totally turned into a marketing video and, and not even a, Hey, this is S group and this is how great it is. But anyways, I don't know, just started going this, this direction, which is fine. Um, but, uh, uh think of the, the mindset of your prospect, what they're going through, right? First, they're going to hear about S group. They're going to hear, Oh, the S group is so great. And, people are making money in it and it's, you know, it's not something new. They've been making money in it for years and years and years. There's trading data going back to 2018. That's extremely positive news. Maybe they come across my content or they come across someone else's content. That was enough talking um, about stuff that, uh, you know, only 3% of people promote. So only 3% of people might be interested in what I was just talking about for the last like 15 minutes. But you know, those 3% of people guys, I really hope that I kind of shone a light on maybe some of the things that you get discouraged on, right? Like when you're promoting out there and your lead is excited, they're interested in what you're doing. And then they come across some scam blog review piece of crap blog um, about what you're promoting that, you know, personally, Hey, that's not true. Like I'm making money with this thing. I've withdrawn. It's changed my life kind of thing like that. I've done lots of withdrawals. You know, guys, that's the kind of feeling I get when someone messages me and sends me a link to some scam review blog thing. When I have, proof that I've made, what is it? $333,000 Canadian through S group. Right. And I've withdrawn uh, 90 something thousand at the moment right now from S group. And then they send me a thing saying that it's a scam. And I'm like, okay, if it was a scam, would I be able to withdraw that much? And would I be sitting here making videos day number 573 review video? Like, <laughs> like honestly, right. So um, yeah, but guys, if you're not an experienced marketer and if you don't make your own content, it's really, really hard to answer that question. Is it a scam or not? Right? Because you don't have the proof to say it's a scam or not. You have to go to someone else's content and say, Hey, look at this. And then now you've just introduced your lead to a leader, <laughs> right? Someone else who's actually out there doing the legwork, making the content and showing that this thing is not a scam and it's freaking amazing. And it can totally change your life. Right? So yeah, guys. Um, yeah, I'm going to stop talking about that, but, um, thought I would just talk about it, but I actually went off about it. So, <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, you can see here, guys, uh, we're at, uh, uh, 1.19. Is that how you'd say 1.1 million, $9,000 last night when I did yesterday's video. Now we're at 1.115,000 here. Okay. So $1,100,015 in the team turnover there. So things, you know, guys, even though they made this little, wee change to the comp plan where we're not earning uh 50% from our downlines, downlines, then below, right. Which doesn't really make a difference from 50% to 33%. Now it's 33%. You can see in my account, it didn't really make a difference, right? I had a hundred dollars of commissions come in. Um, here up here because I have since my last video, right? Uh, sorry, $85 of commissions come in. I have $40 of SWP there now. 
Um, so $85 of commissions came in when I was sleeping. And yeah, still the team turnover went up huge there, right? Uh, six, 6,000 something dollars, right? It went up. So I don't think I'm going to even really feel that little change there. And, you know, if you don't have a big team, like if you have seven or 10 people under you, you know, most likely one or two of those people might be promoting and you probably won't even feel the change in this comp plan, which they just changed, right? It's really only the, I would think the people that are probably maybe at the next level here, the 15%, they might kind of feel it because it is a 17% change, but it's 17% change from your, not your, uh, from your downlines, downlines, and then below. Okay. So most likely you're not going to feel it. Cause if you look at my commissions here, uh, like I can't feel it. Um, these guys here. Okay. So I got a 1.5% commission from this username here. He might be in our EN chat, but I, I don't know who he is. I didn't sponsor him in, him in, and he could be like eight levels down from me, but still I made $14 off that. So he, he funded a thousand something, right? Like 1400 bucks or something like that. Just now, uh, this person here, a 2.5% commission. So this could be from my downlines downline. If my downline didn't fund big, right. Or this could be from my downlines downlines, uh, that level there right? It's very confusing to understand the comp plan here. Here's another one. This is normally what my 1.5% commissions look like is like under a dollar or so. Okay. So 30, 33% of this would be calculated into, into my total team turnover, right? I know him. Um, this guy here, he's a big player in S group. Um, he has a huge team under him. I think he's, he's done the hundred K in sales, there hundred yeah hundred hundred k so he's working towards his five hundred or no I think he's done his five hundred k in sales I think he's probably working towards his million dollar I think he's got the twenty thousand dollar bonus not really sure he's not my direct referral though he's well here I'll give you guys an example of this so you can see my biggest guys here so this guy here okay who's my direct uh, referral there and then we go to her okay. So, you know, my downlines, downlines, and then we go to her. So downlines, 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 and then we go to him. There he is right there. Okay. So you can see from him, guys, I'm getting 1.5, a 1.5% commission. And then it doesn't stop. It just keeps on going at 1.5. Okay. So you can see that. So this is like, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So that's eight levels down. And I'm still making a commission off, off that person there. But, you know, once again, it's 1.5% commission. They would have to fund big for me to make a noticeable um, uh, commission there. Like you can see here, the very last commission that came in was a 1.5% commission. And that was $14.25. Okay. So, you know, that's, that, that's a couple thousand dollars or something like that, right? If it's 1.5% uh, or sorry, around a thousand or so, right? So yeah, you only really feel that on the big um, sales there, okay? I'll just check this. Oh, okay, he, he put in uh, the new calculator update there. So you guys make sure you're in our EN chat channel to grab the newest calculator. Uh, what I've told him to do is to make a mailing list, okay? Like actually make a funnel based around the calculator. And then what we can do is just subscribe to his mailing list and then he'll send us the calculator through email. And then he doesn't have to post it in here every single month and then, or sorry, every single week. And then, so, uh, you know, if you're not on the EN team, right. But you're watching my videos. Like I know there's probably 10 or 12 or whatever people out there that watch these videos every single week that I'm putting out. Um, yeah. And you guys can get that calculator. Okay. That the EN team has made. Okay. So you just jump on his mailing list and then you'll get the updated calculator. And then you don't, you know, cause this, this group here is just for our team, right? I wish everyone could be in it, but it's not actually my group. It's my sponsors group. So I just don't want to like put random people that aren't on our team in it. Right. He, he'd probably uh, be like, why am I supporting these guys? Okay. So anyways, um, that's that guys. We're going to shoot on over here to S wallet. So we'll go to merchant and we'll actually get to the whole purpose of this video. We're going to send 5,700 Canadian to my wife. 
So I'm going to look at what is that. So 5700 CAD to USD because that's going to pay off all the bills for next month. So is uh, uh, 40, so I'll send her 4400 bucks there because I sent her $4,700 the start of the week. Um, yeah, we'll get going here, guys. We're going to go to exchange. Man, I really have to work on my uh, style of these videos and get back to how I used to be. Like before I was promoting S Group, guys, I didn't promote anything for two years. But if you remember my old style of promotion, my videos, would I'd keep them under 15 minutes. I can't do it anymore. I just like, it, it, it doesn't matter to me now. So I don't know. I got I to gotta get back to that though. Okay, so this is going to give me, oh, you know what though? I don't want to sell, I want to sell this much of it because I don't want to be sitting in, in cryptos right now because who who the heck knows, right? So that that's what I need to do is 4,400 US into Ethereum, exchange that guy there. Okay, so Ethereum, so we got to grab her Ethereum address. So we'll shoot on over here. Go to Facebook. Oh, you know what I did too? I sent her a picture of the shed that I built. So I wanted to show you guys that because I've been talking about the shed that I've built um, uh, in my backyard there. Uh, so I'm going to show you guys a picture of that there because I sent it to her with the purpose of showing you guys this. And there it is there. So there's my shed that I built this summer. That's, um, you know, it, it basically everything you see in my backyard, guys, S Group has paid for. The fire pit, the fence, all the lights on it. We live on almost half an acre, so it's a pretty big fence. And then my shed there. And actually, the, the lawn was paid for by S Group, but the lawn we did last year, so it doesn't look all that great because we just had in-ground sprinklers put in, which also S Group paid for. Because as you guys know, S Group and S Group and trading is my only in income, and I don't trade that much anymore. So basically, it's just S Group now. Um, but yeah, there's there's the shed I built, guys. It was a kit, and then I put it together. Um, it's the first time I built a shed, and there's Hayden beside it, my son there. He's almost seven now. He'll be seven in two months, um, standing so you guys can see the size of it. It's a twelve by eight, or no, so, sorry, twelve by nine. So it's a pretty big shed, and uh, we're gonna pack that full of uh, you know the winter stuff all the lawn chairs and these Muskoka chairs and stuff will go in the shed. So yeah, I don't know. I thought I would just show you guys that because the uh, past month since I've been building a shed, yeah, it took me a month to do basically. I've been slacking off with it, but uh, I've been kind of talking about that in my videos, right? Is my shed that I'm building and I'm going to paint it brown, like a nice dark brown color. So it blends in with the back. It's actually the same. I've already bought the paints, the same color as my garage doors, which they're brown. Okay. So <laughs> anyways, there we go there, guys. Um, there's the address. I just want to double check it. So OX and then uh, E49 there. Okay. The max, because you know, I only sold $4,400 of Ethereum in there because that's all she needs um, to pay the monthly bills there. And then I'm going to send that and that's off to the races. Okay. Um, if you're watching this video, which most likely you are, uh, outside of the outside of Canada if you're watching the video because most of my viewers I know are outside of Canada um, I'm using shake pay okay I don't recommend it I recommend if you're outside of Canada just use something else guys use like crypto.com or something shake pay is extremely expensive and also we can't use USDT on the on the Tron network we have to use ethereum or Bitcoin which the network you know is just crazy expensive so I uh, got to put this code in here, which is seven, two, six, seven, two, six. And then I think it was like three, three something. Oh no, three, two, two, three, two, two. And then the email code, just simple, goes into uh, the email that you created your S group, S, uh, sorry, S wallet with. Okay, going back in here to this guy, click on send. And poof, there you go. So that's gone. Um, that was 4,400 USD. So f what was that? 5,700 Canadian or something like that. 4,400 USD to CAD. Yeah, so just under 5,700 um, bucks there. So she should definitely have enough to pay the uh, mortgage and stuff like that. 
with this here for the month. And yeah, pretty awesome. Okay. Uh, and then I'm just going to make another video guys now and I'll call it something else. Like I'm going to actually make a playlist and it'll be about my investment in crypto. So I'm going to take this 4k here because we don't need it to pay bills. And you know, I'm already putting money into my savings, which I don't even like to do that. I don't like to hold the money in the bank, but, um, this money here, guys, we've, me and my wife talked about it and this is, uh, you know, I, I told her my investment plan for crypto. So I'm going to use all 4,000 of this USD and I'm going to go and put it into, um, the exchange that I'm going to use, which is Kraken because we cannot use Binance and I live in Ontario, Canada. We can't use Binance in Ontario, Canada anymore, which really sucks. So I'm going to put that in the new exchange that I'm going to go with. I've been following that exchange for about a year now just to see how safe it is because I am going to put about 15,000 US in it, which is, you know, that's a lot of money for me, right? So, um, yeah, guys, I think it's going to be good. Uh, I feel confident enough in it. There's enough people. I've talked to people that have hundreds of thousands of dollars in it and, you know, they've said, yeah, it's fine. I used one of the guys referral links that I've been following. But the honest truth is, guys, the smartest thing for me to do is to build a passive income. And this is passive. This is definitely passive income, right? So anyways, let's go, let's go back here to transactions, see if it's gone through. Nope, still not yet. Okay. Network might be slow today. So anyways, we'll end it here, guys. I got to edit this video and I'll see you guys in another video. This video, I'm sorry. Once again, it was a lot of blah, blah, blah stuff that only 3% of people would care about because they only 3% of people promote. But for those 3% of people that do promote, um, I hope that you did get, you know, as I was talking at the start of the video, guys, about promotion and stuff and, and strategies and mindset. I hope that you did take something from that um, and, and made you think. And if you did, maybe go out there, make your own content about it and share that with other people if it makes sense to you, right? Okay. I used to do that a lot when I first started marketing is if I didn't know what to talk about, I'd get ideas from other people that made sense to me. And I talk about that, like recycle content basically, right? So see you guys. Bye-bye.